turn on? I will turn on the Beamer. As you can see, I turned on Beamer using my voice, which is because I implemented a system using ODPS3 and the ODP Workbench to turn on the Beamer, which is controlled over the internet. Today I'm going to show you how to increase the system in such a way that I can only turn also turn off the Beamer by my voice. First of all, I'm switching to Dialog Designer View and I'm going to extend the Beamer ontology. I already have an existing user task for turning on the Beamer and I'm adding a new one for turning it off. This user task needs also to be a service request. After doing that, I'm switching to Package Explorer view and I'm extending my Beamer service which also already re uh, reacts to uh, a request which is turning off the Beamer. So I'm adding a new else if case where I want to react if the request is an instance of turning off the Beamer, my newly added ontology concept which I also have to import into my Java class. I want to turn off the Beamer and I want to set the response status of the request to new status success. Switching back to Dialog Designer view, I'm increasing Beamer service and adding a subscription for turning off the Beamer. And that's all I have to do for extending the backend. Next step. I'm taking a look at a task model where I already have a task execution definition for turning on the Beamer and I'm adding a new one for turning off the Beamer. Next step, increasing the grammar for speech recognition. I'm adding a new rule where I utter turn off, I want to assign the semantics of a request task with the content turning off the Beamer. Last but not least, I'm going to extend the generation template where I want to react on a successful report on task of turning off the Beamer. So I get as input a uh, report on task as with a task status of released and a task execution result which is turn off the beamer and adding a verbalization such as OK. So let's try this. Switching back to Package Explorer, I'm launching my system. And I'm launching Control Panel from the Workbench, connecting the Control Panel to the system, opening the microphone, turn off. OK. That's it.